I'm Captain Lawson and I'm here again to give you an update on the City of Fenton Precinct. During the video presentation in February 2023, I mentioned our department's motto to serve and protect that is on our uniform patches and the decals on our patrol cars. The officers assigned to the City of Fenton Precinct follow this motto on a daily basis as they perform their duties and responsibilities to serve and protect the citizens and businesses in our community. Unfortunately, in spite of the best efforts of our officers, some criminal elements of society continue to travel into our business, residential, and recreational areas to commit crimes such as stealing, property damage, vehicle tampering and theft, and assault. Please be assured in those instances when a criminal has entered our community and committed a crime, our officers will use their skills and the available investigative tools to bring the case to a successful resolution within the criminal justice and courts systems. During the past two months, our officers have been successful on several occasions in recovering occupied stolen vehicles being driven through our city through the use of license plate reader cameras. Additionally, many of our businesses in the retail and light industrial areas have great surveillance cameras that have been valuable in assisting our officers in identifying suspects and bringing many cases to a successful conclusion. As the seasons change and the weather warms up, we'll see more visitors to our parks and recreational facilities. This may create new opportunities for criminal activity, including car break-ins and even thefts. I encourage you to continue to be vigilant and lock your cars and keep your valuables out of sight. We must work together as a team to prevent future criminal activity, which may negatively impact the quality of life in our community. On a more positive note, I would like to acknowledge the actions of three of our officers from the City of Fenton Precinct during the last several months. On Sunday, October 16, 2022, at 1042 a.m., Officer Jared Abeloff located a pile of salvaged scrap metals that had been forcefully removed from several rooms at a closed motel. As a result of his observations and investigation, Abeloff was able to locate and arrest the suspect who had broken into the business. The suspect was charged with burglary second degree by the St. Louis County Prosecuting Attorney's Office. Good work, Jared and thank you for your commitment to protecting the businesses in the city. On Sunday, January 8, 2023, at 5.51 p.m., while off duty and in his resident officer car, Officer Brad Hollenbach responded to a call for a house fire in the South County Precinct. Upon arrival, Brad was able to utilize a department fire extinguisher to prevent a fire on the residential carport from spreading prior to the arrival of the fire department. The responding Melville fire captain stated that the response and actions of Officer Hollenbach assisted in preventing the fire from spreading into the gable vents and the attic, which could have resulted in more extensive damage to the residents. Brad, your work is a fantastic example of our motto to serve and protect. Thank you for your commitment to the citizens of St. Louis County. The third recognition goes to Officer Jody Franey for her generous support of the St. Vincent de Paul Society's Christmas Adopt-A-Family program. On Tuesday, March 14, 2023, our department was made aware of her yearly commitment and assistance to the St. Vincent de Paul Society and their mission to build personal relationships and serve people in need. Thank you, Jody, for your dedication to the service and commitment of the citizens in the city of Fenton. Thank you to you, the citizens, who we serve with pleasure every day. Your ongoing support is greatly appreciated by our officers. Take care and stay safe. Mm -hmm.